Hi friends, welcome to School Kids. Myself Leah. Today I am going to take the topic motion in 9th standard CBSC. So, so let's start. What is a motion? It is a change in position of a body is known as a motion. Let's see with an example. If a man standing at a point A, then he moves from point A to B. What's happening here? It's pos his position changes from point A to B. Now he is at point B. So we can simply say that change in position is known as a motion. Right? Motion is change in position of a body with respect to a reference point. So what is, what is the reference point? It is a fixed point about which a motion is taken place. Consider an example. If I am then starting this journey from a point A to B, here point A is a starting point of journey. So we can say that it is a reference point. In a solar system, Earth is moving around the sun. Sun is a fixed point. So, here reference point is a sun. Right? If we move 2 km from a building, says that building is reference point. Generally we can take reference point as stationary object like tree, building etc. In a moving object also we can take as reference point. Consider example. If two cars are A and car B moves in a row. If car A overtake car B, then we can say that car B is moved with respect to A. So here A is a reference point for a car B. Right? So what is a reference point? It is a fixed point about which a motion is take place. Set point with respect to which a body say its position is known as a reference point. Understood? If a boy moves from 
his house to school after entering church the top distance between school and house are 2 km 3 km for a distance it is a total length covered by a body is known as a distance so here distance is equal to 2 plus 3 km it travel Okay. Next, what is a displacement? It is the shortest distance between final and initial position. What is final position here? Here, school is final position and house is initial position, right? So, shortest distance between them is one kilometer. Say one kilometer. So, displacement is shortest distance between. final and initial position right so it is 1 km not 5 km right displacement equal to 1 km answer another example moves in a straight line then we can say that distance and displacement are equal say so it is 10 km so here distance is equal to 10 km and displacement also 
Here, distance is a scalar quantity and displacement is a vector quantity. What is scalars and vectors? Physical quantity which has magnitude only is known as scalar quantity and if you measure direction also it is vectors. So here displacement is a vector quantity. In case of displacement we have to measure magnitude and direction word to word. distance we measure only the magnitude distance and displacement are measured in meters or kilometer centimeter right so unit of distance and displacement are meter. Here unit is also meter or kilometer. Right. Distance is always positive. Why it is positive? It is measure the total path covered by a body. That's why it is positive. And it is greater than or equal to displacement. Right. Distance always greater than or equal to displacement. Next, displacement is positive, negative, zero. Displacement is always less than or equal to distance. That's all about distance and displacement. Thank you all.